guys, it's Jenna from So Stitch and Create, and today I'm going to show you how to make a DIY no sew easy face mask. So here are things you will need. Some fabric, I'm using this owl one, you want something that you like, that you would sleep in. A pen or pencil or marker, something to write with. Some scissors, ribbon, but I ran out of ribbon so I'm using this string a hot glue gun and last but not least a um template i need this i will leave the link in the description below if i can and yeah so without further ado let's get started i'm just gonna hot up heat up my hot glue gun the plug is kind of far away i can barely reach i'll have to keep moving the camera but anyways so now, I'm going to move the camera, okay? And so you're going to start off by getting your fabric, and you want to fold it in half any way you like. I'm just doing it this way. And on one, you're going to get just one side of it. Well, I made a mistake. I'm actually, you're actually supposed to do it the other way because you're gonna need to draw and you don't want to draw on your good fabric. Like that. And you can even flip it over. And you should have something that looks like that. So you're gonna get your mask. It depends if you can see it from the bottom. You might want to put it inside so I'm just gonna insert mine in just like so and fold it like that now you are going to try your best to trace around it and I wish you all Finish tracing. I'm just gonna take out the template, and now you should have something that looks like that. I'm kind of gonna fold it more down. And wow, I just forgot to include something. You're gonna for one of the materials. You're gonna need some stuffing. Very little though. So now you're just going to cut around it. Don't want to waste fabric so try cutting the least amount as possible so I have cut this now you just want to cut both sides so you should have two of the exact okay, guys so my fabric has been all cut out so here are the two pieces this one kind of because of the fold of the fabric it makes it look smaller but when you line them up they are pretty even so now what you're going to want to do is you're going to flip one of your eye things over and you're going to get some stuffing and you're only going to need a little bit of stuffing but you want to make it comfy you're not gonna need a lot, just like really break it up just to make it feel comfy, like the way you would want it. You wanna make sure it's really broken up because you don't want like big chunks. But at the same time, you want it like to be comfy enough that you wanna sleep with it. So I think that's probably good for now. So now I'm gonna get my hot glue gun and I'm just going to heat it up. You wanna let your um, I think, I keep keeping I think, eye mask sit. And you wanna make sure there's space for when you glue the second one on. So I'm just gonna make sure there's space for that. Okay. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and start make, I like unfolding them more because 
don't like how they're folded and I'll see you when my hot glue gun is okay, heated so up. So my hot glue gun has finally heated up. So I have a bra, my thing, my eye mask. I keep saying thing. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my hot glue gun and on and this side, I'm just gonna glue a straight line. We want to do the gluing part, part step by step because we don't want to ruin it. So I'm going to get it. Oh, that was a bad idea because this part is matching that part. Um. Hold on. I'm so I'm gonna do it this way. Hold on. Okay, I'm just gonna make this part of this. And so that's for the part where you put inside your eyes. So I'm just going to place it. Now, I don't know why, but for some reason while I was cutting, it somehow got uneven. But that's okay. Ooh, wow. Okay, that did not go out as planned. Okay, so um, once you have done that part, You're gonna continue going a step. Well, this part's gonna be kind of tricky. Step by step into gluing it. I keep burning myself today with the hot glue gun. Okay. So you're just gonna wanna press. And I'm going to stop the camera right here cause you're just gonna keep going and I'll show guys, you when So I'm done. I finished. Oh my God, guys, it's so soft. Like it's not so soft that like you can't wear it, but it's like really nice and padded. And so here it is. And life doesn't always go as wanted. I forgot to mention that you're supposed to get your string and um, put it attached to there. But you know what, it's still fine. We're still gonna do this. So I'm just gonna get rid of this but loose bad end. And so what you're going to do is you're going to get the string and put it together and just split it in the middle. So now you can turn it over. At least this is the bad side, like. Guys, I don't know, I was making a project today. I had literally used four houses. And this is my fifth one today. I need to go slower. Okay, so where'd my string go? I'm just going to put right there some glue and attach your string. And after I do that, I like to just give it one layer of secureness. Now you're going to go to the next side and do the same with the second string. So you're just gonna apply some hot glue right there. Attach your string and secure. Now see guys, that's it. You are done with this project. So I'm not gonna be able to model right now because it's still drying, but like it's so padded and soft. And so you put it around your head and then you tie it so you can make it, if you want it to be small or bigger. And guys, you can use this for so many things. Like I know a lot of people do um, blindfolded slime challenge. You can use this instead of buying if you don't have one. Yeah. No. There go. It is planned. Planned. I just said planned. Gosh. So yeah. Remember to hit like and subscribe, and click the thumbs up. And see you next video.